what is going on everybody my name is star lords i hope that you guys are having a fantastic day because i know i am i am absolutely loving this game it seems that every single public server that i go into i am never being able to be killed like honestly i survive every single shot that people come at me like honestly i kill everybody and we've got a couple of people in today's uh, lobby they're actually uh, people who know me from youtube and some people who are really just amazed at how good like my powers are in this game uh, but today i'm actually going to be showing you guys a secret crystal that you can find on the map where you can actually train your superhero and get amazing amounts of points whilst actually training there it's insane you definitely need it if you want to become one of the most powerful superheroes or super villains in this game and uh, yeah before we do get into the video guys we are now at over 300,000 subscribers on YouTube if you haven't already subscribed yet please click subscribe and also remember to leave a like on the video guys as it does help me out and also I am going to be doing a Robux giveaway sometime in the future so you do not definitely want to miss out on that click on the notification bell to never miss any of my uploads because if you do you're pretty silly because it's free Robux so yeah uh, but anyway we're in today's game and as you can see there's a load of people right here and I think that I am the only person who's a super villain in this game right now and and if I just go and show you really quickly, like, I am absolutely killing it with how powerful I am. I literally one-hit everybody on this game now. Wait, who's this? Hey, hey, there's a guy right there. I can see you still. You're not invisible. Hey, get back here. What are you doing? Uh, but basically, guys, as you can see, when I'm actually floating in midair, I get 320 psychic power. I have absolutely beasted this game, like, seriously. And if I go over to this uh, tornado over here... You'll actually see that in this little bit of tornado right here, when you have the fly option available, you can actually go inside of it to get body toughness. And look how much body toughness I'm getting right there. I'm getting 3,000... 200 every single second of body toughness that is how crazy that is my next level is going to be the volcano but unfortunately as of right now i don't i'm not actually able to survive the volcano which is kind of poopy but if we go to the menu you guys can actually see what all of my level statistics are and everything like that as you can see it is pretty crazy the only two things that i have that are really bad on this game is movement speed and jump force like genuinely i can never get my movement speed better it's so bad and it's so hard to upgrade but uh, as you can see i am doing pretty good and i also have the vip setting too and uh, yeah today i'm actually going to be showing you guys like i said the secret crystal and where to find it and how exactly to find it too and um so for example here we are here at the um at the spawn, right? And uh, a lot of you guys will know that to actually get up, uh, get up your, like, this one, what is it? It's the train fish strength. You need to go over here and punch this rock, right? So as you can see, every time I punch this rock, me personally, I am getting 640 fish strength from this and this is actually really really good and over the last day or two i've actually been see seeing people who can fly training here punching this and i was very confused i was like wait why aren't you finding the secret crystal you do know there's a secret crystal right so i actually showed a load of people where to find this crystal to train even higher and even better in this game and uh, that's what we're gonna do so basically guys once you've actually unlocked the fly feature as you can see i can fly around pretty much everywhere right here and uh, what you want to do is from this little dude right here from sath what you want to do is head towards shut up phone what you want to do is head towards this uh, kind of windmill kind of area over here not a windmill it's a it's a tornado. So we're going to head towards the tornado, guys. And what a lot of people actually don't realize is that this tornado doesn't just have these three layers. So it has the bottom layer, the middle layer, and this top layer. But it also has another layer above it. And not many people actually notice this because from far away, when you're far away from this, you can't really see it that well. I don't know. Normally, you can't really see it because the sun's kind of in your eyes. So see, you can't really see it that much. But if we just fly all the way over to this uh, tornado over here and get on top of this cloud, you will actually know that there is a little platform on top of the cloud where you can kind of walk around on. And as you can see, guys, there is actually a crystal right there. A crystal is right there. Yeah. And uh, if we just go over to it for a second, really quickly, go to really close, we can actually punch this crystal. And as you can see, guys, I am now getting 6,400 fish strength when I'm actually punching this crystal every single second. There's an ice cream van outside. 
Huh, okay. It's pretty much winter, dude, so why are you outside? Uh, but yeah, as you can see, dude, this is actually the best place to train your fish strength. And I've noticed that not many people actually know this even exists. Because everyone is still constantly training over at this rock, which genuinely, guys, it doesn't even give you that much. Like, it gives me 54. Oh, wait, no, sorry. Five, uh, 600, 640. 640 fish strength. But... I could be up here training by this crystal right here, earning way more than that. And uh, I thought, you know what, I would just kind of make a guide on this because I know for a fact that not a lot of people have actually, uh, not a lot of pe people actually know what this is. Like, for example, this dude, this, I don't even know if he knew, knew it was here. Look, now he's punching it. I don't think he knew it was here because I have not seen him here all game. So that's absolutely insane. I've been in the server for like seriously around about like 60 minutes or something like that. Like, let me see how long I've got left. I've only got like nine more minutes until I have unlocked my next rank requirement. That's really cool. Uh, but yeah, guys, I just kind of thought I'd make a video on this and uh, ask you guys, did you actually know about that area? Did you personally know that you could go to that crystal and actually level up and everything? Because not many people actually did. So uh, yeah, if you guys want to see more guides from me, by the way, like, please tell me in the comment section below what type of videos you want me to make on this game and also Pet Simulator too. Oh, dude, this guy's trying to kill me. Oh, dude, you are not going to kill me. You are nowhere near going to kill me. Come on, punch me again, bro. Punch me. Punch me. Come on, you're going to die every time you punch me, you silly billy. Silly, silly billy. Dude, that's hilarious. Let's see if he knows where I am. <gasps> he can see me invisible. No way. He's actually a close level to me. I hope he doesn't try and kill me then, because I actually only have like 9 minutes left on that rank requirement. Uh, but of course you guys already know that the 100 body, to uh, the, the body toughness here is good, the body toughness is there good. Um, once you've actually moved on from that, what you can actually do is once you've got over, I think it's 100,000 body toughness, you can actually come to this like kind of freezing area right here, and... You pretty much get 100, uh, sorry, 1,280 body toughness from there. Then, of course, at this uh, tornado down here, we can actually go and uh, underneath, see this little cloud bit area? If you stand in this cloud area bit, it'll actually give you 3,200. And then, of course, you know, the last one is the volcano. The only things that we're really missing on this game is a place to train our psychic ability. Because, as you guys could probably see on the right-hand side of my screen right here, it says, train psychic power, and I've got 3,800,000, or 814,000, 568 uh, already completed, but I need a hundred million of that and there's nowhere at all to train your psychic powers other than fly around and earn 320 per se like per second, which is just not good enough. So like I really want them to add in like a temple or something like that where psychics can kind of sit inside or something like a wizard tower or something maybe, you know what I mean? Like it'd be cool if he added in like the, uh, the kind of like I guess it's like the building from Doctor Strange, you know, the Sanctorium Sanctuary or something like that it's called. Like, yeah, it'd be really cool if you could, like, go inside a temple, sit inside there and have, like, an aura around you to give you more psychic. Other than that, though, I think the only things that are lacking in this game is the jump force, the psychic power, and sometimes the movement speed. Because even the movement speed's a bit annoying to get up. Like, let me see. If I'm running, I put on this 100 ton thing, don't I? And do I run with it? Yeah. So I get 160 every second, which is just not good enough because that's so difficult to get. Like movement speed is genuinely something very, very difficult to get. So genuinely, like there needs to be better ways to upgrade your character because these are just really, really difficult. Hey, what are you doing? Get away from me. Die, die, die. Let's see if I can get anyone else. Let me see. Like, I've just been killing everyone trying to get, like... So, as you can probably see in the bottom right-hand corner, I need to kill 1,000 villains and heroes. So, what I've basically been doing is just kind of flying around the map. I don't really spawn kill that much, but I do kind of, like, go around trying to get my rank up. Because, obviously, the only way to get your rank up right now is to basically kill people. Like, so it's really silly. And it means that I'm going to have to kill a load of people, which is really kind of, kind of poopy, because I don't want to annoy people in this game at all. But I know for a fact that killing people when they're close to spawn and everything, they are going to get annoyed. And I really don't want to have to do that. I really don't. But unfortunately, 
It's just the way it is, guys. So if I kill you when you join my game, I am really sorry. I apologize. But other than that, guys, I pretty much want to say that I've got a private server now that you guys can join if you want to. So feel free to add me as a friend on Roblox. Uh, I'll wait there a second. I'll just kind of put my name up on screen for you guys. It's the legendary Star Lord. No spaces. All you have to do is add me or follow me as a friend. I've got my server completely open so you can join it whenever you want and train without anybody kind of killing you and everything like that. So uh, yeah, I just want to say thank you very much for the awesome comments in all of my latest videos you guys are awesome and uh, yeah i guess i just have a really awesome day enjoy the weekend and until next time i mean star lord see ya